This is a relay clock I built over a period of some eight months. I'll just take the cover off to give you a better view. The method of construction I've chosen is to have all the wiring, relays, diodes and all the components visible and on show. Here are the three ring counters, the seconds, minutes and hours. And in the top right corner is a pulse generator fed from the mains cable, so it's always in sync with the time. Then there's a diode matrix which feeds the time display and the control panel. And we'll get to this little bit shortly. So let's switch it on and see what happens. And show you how it's set up. There's the pulse generator working. And on the control panel, we'll switch on the ring counter and we'll press the clear and the set there's the display working we'll switch on the pulse generator feed and we can see the seconds ticking over now if we switch it into 12 hour mode we have an am indication ring counters are ticking away now I'll demonstrate how we can set the time so we'll switch off the pulse generator feed Time display has stopped. Now, if we press the rapid on the seconds, we can set the seconds and single step it. And the same goes for the minutes and single step and the hours and single step. If we set the hours to, for instance, 10 p.m., and then we change to 24 hour mode, you can see that it's 22, 24, and we have lost the AM, PM display. Let's switch the pulse generator feed back on. It's now counting seconds in 24 hour mode. I'll just show you what this little display on the left is all about. All fed by lots of diode matrices and wires. 